Hello Pisces, welcome to Brutal Jewel Tarot and this reading for the second half of November. So let's check what are the messages for you. Messages for Pisces. What you can expect in this week. Four of Chalices. The Oak King. Standing stone, page of pentacles, Three of Wands. Okay. So here we have the Standing Stone. Maybe your person is dealing with something that you are unaware of. Okay, this person is feeling like that um, you are being quite demanding. I'm not saying that you are being demanding but for them at least for now they just can't uh, meet your expectations maybe and the problem is that they are not saying anything they are not explaining it and you also don't understand why they're behaving in this way here with this four of chalices this person has made you upset really upset maybe they promised you something but uh, they never stick to their promise and they're afraid of showing their weakness Weakness in the sense that uh, they are feeling that they are unable to change their conditions, they are unable to deal with their current situation, they are unable to break free out of something that is holding them back. Maybe you are dealing with someone who is already married or who is already committed or this could be about their family members and uh, there is something that is unconventional about this relationship. It could be about something that is so different, your cultures, maybe your age difference or something else. So this person is um, trying to make these things possible. This person is trying hard to make this relationship work. They actually want you. They are standing here with this cup, but um, they can't offer it to you looks like that uh, they are troubled by their mind here we have the oak king they have feelings for you in their heart but their mind is telling them something else this person feels like that practically fulfilling all your demands is not possible for them right now and maybe your your frustration is also justified this person has kept you waiting for so long and now again there you are listening the same reply so it's really frustrating and um, this is something that is making you think twice looks like that this second half is going to be quite complicated one you're going to make a decision for yourself and that's good that's fine but um, here with this page of pentacles this person will try to stop you definitely this person feels like you mean everything to them emotionally this person is dedicated they are loyal they feel like that you are magic and um, there is nothing that can replace you this person is not even thinking about leaving this relationship but the question is they don't know what the future of this relationship is 
what they can do to make it work. They are afraid of something. Practically, this person is thinking about um, keeping some relationships safe. They are afraid of making others unhappy. Maybe they don't want to deal with the divorce or maybe they don't want to upset their family members or something like that. So this person is having a hard time. This person does no, just don't know what to say. They don't want to say a goodbye to you. They don't want to say a goodbye to anyone else. This person is totally confused. And of course they are putting you in dilemma. They are risking you here. And uh, you know this is time to give a good consideration about this whole situation because with the three of wands you are standing here. You are thinking about leaving already maybe. You know that uh, they can't keep you waiting forever. This person needs to make a decision. Their indecisiveness is costing you a lot. Maybe they have taken away your mental peace totally. However, this is a general reading. This is not going to resonate for all. And the energy could be reversed as well. Also, you can check your moon and horizon sign. Let's go ahead and check some more messages for you. Messages for Pisces. Eight of Pentacles. Two of Chalices. Queen of Wands. Knight of Pentacles. And Four of Pentacles. So, Pisces, Knight of Pentacles is here. This person is serious about you. This person loves you, but again, they are too slow. They are progressing really slow. And uh, here we have four of pentacles. This person is driven by some kind of greed. Most probably um, your companionship. This person is addicted to you. Your personality. And everything else. And um, also they want to know more about you. Like what you're thinking and what you're doing. This could also have something to do with pentacles. Maybe you're supporting them financially. Because here we have eight of pentacles and four of pentacles. You are working good. You are doing good. You are getting the rewards of what you have done. Okay. This second half of November is bringing you a lot of luck and a lot of uh, prosperity. And uh, this person will leave no opportunity to celebrate that. They will be with you. You will again feel connected to them. This person also feels connected to you. There is this beautiful friendship, beautiful relationship. But again, what you should do here? You should be thinking about yourself. The tarot is telling you to focus on yourself. Make sure whom you trust and what you choose for yourself. Because you are queen of wands, Pisces. You are confident, you are attractive. You are a leader and you can make a decision for yourself. So keeping patience with this person could be tough for you. And um, in the end, maybe you are the only one who is giving constantly and uh, you are not getting enough in return or equal in return. So think about it. Let's check a message for you. Yes. 
Change beckons. The path is shifting. The road leads a new way. Do not be alarmed as change beckons to there. Maybe you need to shift to the new direction. Do not be afraid of the change. The change will bring you a lot of happiness. You need to make a decision and then follow that. So this was the reading for the second half of November. I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Till next video. Bye.